everyone, welcome back. The late afternoon here in Zamora. Expat living in the Philippines here, Michael, your host. Well, I'm looking at the the rabbit house, the native thatched, thatched cottage that is. So we haven't made a lot of progress today, but you can just see on the top of the apex there of the gable is some of the ridge ridging iron. So we got halfway with that then then our workers didn't show up after lunch well one of them didn't hasn't come this morning and the other one left it for lunch and hasn't come back so anyway so we carried on with that one well I did <laughs> so there's not much to show you about this apart from the ridging iron so what I do want to show you is um, we we'll walk towards a big mango tree now the sun is getting to maybe two hours away from setting and it's shining on there so let's go and have a look at this big mango tree to see the progress of wrapping the mango fruit. So walk with me. And you can see better now the, the different shades of the, um, the different greens now of the mango, of the new growth. that the amount of wrappings has been done is growing because you can't wrap every individual fruit because some of them will not have been pollinated so the contract you know is which is which by the sheer size of the mangoes and the mangoes that he thinks will ripen okay that's the one he's wrapping so <coughs> a circuit around it and when you come up looking up through the canopy here you can see that she what we'll do is walk up through and let me show you the size of this and it's like a, a cathedral you know it's going up Walking through, it's got a lovely feeling, you know. It's um, some of this sort of thing here needs needs to be cut and lifted up, lifting up the canopy. But it's a big job when we haven't even got a pair of scissors, let alone a chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and here is coming to the other side. Of course, the workers, the other workers, the contractors, parking their bikes here because it's a lovely and shady spot. I think there's still one ladder up here somewhere. So they've been they've been wrapping here on this tree alone for three days now. You know? <laughs> so they just come out. On the other side. Here now is again just the sheer majesty of this tree. Yeah. Incredible. Yeah, yeah. And there's still more wrapping to do on this tree yet, so. Yeah. Spectacular, isn't it? It's, um, we'll go down to the bottom end. probably tomorrow when these get the difference in size between this one and that one so we we'll probably like maybe tomorrow wrap this one that will be probably discarded it's no good it's yellow so it's mean it's no good already you know so and this one too maybe no good but maybe not so if I can just see get the camera to look up there you can see the um, mango inside 
don't know if you can see it's like show through. You um put it down, yeah, yeah. There. Yeah. Maybe in there there's a mango, you can see it wrapped in there, it's bigger than anything else. Oh yeah. So that's our big tree. There's another one further down, just as big. And yeah, so is called Teresa, not Teresa Green either. <laughs> we call it Teresa. Well, I do because she's the mother of the trees here, you know. Mm -hmm. Mother Teresa uses the joke saying, Teresa, Teresa, who? Teresa Green. <laughs> That's an old English joke, you know, that we should tell at school. Oh, <laughs> things like this. They get, like when you used to say, Knock, knock. Who's there? Amos. Amos who? A mosquito. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Stupid little jokes, you know, like that. So, anyway, that's mother. Uh, uh, Teresa is her name. I'm down here, it's just the same. The new grass is growing now because have, we have no cow. So, we'll try and make hay for that for the rabbits now. So manually make the hay, like the old style. And that's it. You see the uh, Zola ponds in the distance. It's making more and more Zola now. We'll head back to the cottage. I'll feed out the rabbits. And shower time. Thanks for watching, guys, as always. I always look forward to bringing videos because I know it's the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So God bless you all, eh? and really I mean that, just take care because we never know what's happening in this world at the moment. So, hey, let's live life while we can. <laughs> Give you an update later. Bye for now.